Thanks to Martin for the York races. We're off to Windsor for the Windsor listed race. I've had nine phones for two year olds. One is Power and Ambition for Leon from Rensburg. Two is Chain wins a lot. Three is Inside Skull Ben Benici. Four Mystic Guy Dan Hughes. Five Panto Rosso Darren Thompson. Six is Sweet Tooth. Seven Torn Shell. Eight is Auntie Social. Nine Bronx Cave Girl. Ten is Rempress Aileen Patrick Hogan. Eleven is Grand Harbour Kevin Minigan. Twelve Po Valley Martin Needham. And thirteen Sundial for Ken and Minigan. At the start, and away they go in this TO listed race. Power and Ambition got a good start, also Punter Ross are quickly out, but both of them are not willing to lead. And it's the Martin Leader Horse, Poe Valley, who goes up on the outside. Josh uh, Sutherland, Sweet Tooth, also going forward, and it's Sweet Tooth and now picks it up and goes clear by some three lengths from Poe Valley in second. Torrent Charles behind that with Mystic Guard traveling quite wide, also very wide. The Ben Benici horse inside Skull uh, behind that, also wide is Bronx Cave Girl. Then Emperor Sileen for Patrick Hagen dropping back now is Mystic Guard. And at the back of the field, the two Kevin Meenigan horses, Sen Sundal and Grand Harbour. Some 10 lengths off this leader, who's Sweet Tooth, escaped by 6 lengths now. Sweet Tooth leads for Joshua Sutherland, those red and black striped from uh, Martin Needham's Poe Valley in second. Then comes Chams, wins a lot for David Roberts, and on the rail is Power and Ambition. Um, out wide of that is Torrin for Paul Rose, and very wide is Bronx Cave Girl. In between horses and starting to prove is Grand Harbour. The Ben Benici horse is dropping back, that's an inside skull, travelling very wild. He's anti-social and up the inside Emperor's Island he's starting to get closer. Four fillers left to travel in this listed race at for two year olds and it's uh, Sweet Tooth is clear. Uh, the lead is reduced now to about three lengths and the Darren Thompson punter Rosso is moving closer out wide getting closer as well as Bronx Cave Girl. Power Ambition is still here. Here comes Empress Arlene shooting through from the back of the field and a Sweet Tooth now tries to shoot that sail for home but Empress Arlene is a lively chain on it on the outside then punter Rosso and Power Ambition trying to get going and there's a mystic guy it's Sweet Empress Arlene from Sweet Tooth. Here comes Power and Ambition. Um, Punter Rosa and Mystic Guide out wide. Bronx Cave Girl. Empress Arlene for Patrick Hogan has the lead from Sweet Tooth trying to fight back. Mystic Guide for Dan Hughes is fine. Then Bad Power and Ambition. It's still Empress Arlene. Sweet Tooth is coming back at him. Sweet Tooth picks it up again. He has Mystic Guide. Power and Ambition. Mystic Guide. Power and Ambition. That's very close. It looked like Mystic Guide might have got there. But the angle can be deceiving. Oh, that's very close. Power Ambition has got there to beat Mystic Guide on the shadow of the post. Uh, third was Sweet Tooth for Joshua Sutherland, who found another gear that came back at them, but had no answer to the two uh, the two that finished at the front of him. Power Ambition, the winner. Mystic Guard, second for Dan Hughes. Then Sweet Tooth, Joshua Sutherland. Punter Rosso was, was fourth for Darren Thompson. And Bronx Cave Girl for Vinnie Gerald was back in fifth place.